A scientist race for a drug and vaccine for COVID-19. We've been asked to adhere to safety protocols to help prevent the spread of the virus. Now, one of the safety protocols is hand washing. There has been uh, or there have been many inventions of hand washing machines. And now, how about a hand washing machine, which is manual, which is big enough for four people to use at the same time, ensuring social distancing? Now, Eric RJ comes through with the following report. Scientists across the world continue to race for a vaccine and a drug for the COVID-19 virus. While at it, we've been told that we have to adhere to certain safety protocols. And these protocols will help us to combat the spread of the COVID-19 virus. One of such protocols is the washing of hands. Um, since it became critical for us to ensure that we wash our hands often, Individuals and organizations continue to come out with innovations to help us observe this particular protocol. Behind me are some machines that have been invented and they are quite innovative in the sense that we have one unit where four people can wash their hands at the same time So I have with me Kinsley Beidou. He's one of the brains behind what you see in your shot. And I want him to tell us the rationale behind this and those ones that you see there. Well, the rationale behind uh, the invention is that with the emergence of this COVID-19 pandemic, we realized the Veronica bucket was trending. But with that of the Veronica bucket, you use your hand to open the tap and you use the same hands to close the tap. We saw it to be dangerous. So as engineers, we sat down and planned that we have to do a system whereby instead of using your hands to operate, you rather use your legs. Hence, the invention of the short body super hand washing machine. So run us through the various processes. So when you approach it, what is the first thing you do, then you continue? Well, if you see the, the sandwich on the, on the machine, uh, definitely you don't use your hands, you use your legs. We have a section that dispenses soap. We have a section that dispenses water. Then, even if there's a water shortage and you still need to clean your hands, we have a section for sanitizer. After washing your hands with the soap, there's another chamber for the tissue. And what is so marvelous about our machine is that, our invention is that, the paper towel you see there comes from our own factory as well. We have paper towel factory too. Then from the paper towel, we have the dustbin. You just put the waste into the dustbin. So basically, this is how the machine operates. Then it can, there, there can be a situation where there wouldn't be uh, light. Maybe there's, there's light off or darkness. When there's darkness, automatically this light you see here is solar operated. It will, it will come on. And the more you get nearer to it, the more it gets brighter. So, so the light, it, it, yeah, so the light you see there does not form part of the mechanism of the machine, but it is just to give it lightning. Okay. So um, you, you control this with the paddles? Yes, you, you control, can I demonstrate yes. it for you? You control this with a paddle. I need my soap. So the soap, I've gotten my soap. Now, I need my water. I have my water. This is my tissue. So when you yeah, yeah, so when you place this, it will come gravity, open the valve like this. Yeah. Then I, pin, I, I open my dustbin and put the waste in it. Assuming, assuming the water is finished in the tank, then I'll use my hand sanitizer. Yeah, it seems it's finished. Mm. I'll use my sanitizer. Yeah. So this waste waste water, where will it end? Well, it depends on the it, it, it depends on where you will mount the machine. But um, what we thought is that we will definitely mount it at a place that is nearer 
to a, a gutter or a drain. Yeah. So enter into the. Yes, please. Okay. So um, it is <laughs> now. How do you fill this? So how do you fill this too? Well, you see the container. So you just put whatever. If this is liquid soap or hand sanitizer, you put it in. It will run through the the system over there. You see the cylinders over there. They, they, they is the main reservoir. So that is how the system is. Okay. And if it is getting finished or if it is full, how will you know? We have we have the tube here. We have the capillary tube here. Okay. The rise and fall of the liquid in it. So when it is full, you you see you see it in the capillary tube. So what is the size of this and the tanks there? This is 12 liters, and the cylinder there is um, 15 liters, meaning it can last for about a month. Oh, okay. Depending on where you depending mount. on where you mount it. Okay. Assuming you want to connect it to a pipe system, how, what, do you have a mechanism that will allow you to do that? Yeah, we've made a provision for that. If you see this uh, pipe, that, that is where you connect the pipe to it to fill the tank. Okay. So really for this one, what is the motivation? I'm sure that this is... You mount this where you have a lot of people. Yeah. There's like the lorry parks, the banks, places that a lot of people gather. Yeah, you see, if you compare this four in one to that of the two in one or the one, the one, you realize that um, this one is all about that, that social distance we are talking about. If you mount this in the marketplace or at the marketplace, just imagine the number of people that will use the machine. Why we did this is to, one, help for people not to breach the law on social distancing and in order not to bring pressure on the machine. That is the main reason why we, we did this uh, four in one, so that a lot of people can use it. If you go to them, if you put it at the marketplace, look at the number of people in the market. This, with this one, a lot of people can use it. So this machine has come in handy, particularly so when our COVID-19 cases continue to rise. We believe that when we have a lot of these dotted advantage points, we'll be able to continue to adhere to the safety protocol of washing our hands, so we'll be able to combat the spread of the COVID-19 virus. Talking about innovation that kills time as well, of course. Now you may not have to queue at supermarkets waiting to wash your hand before you step in because you get the chance to wash while someone else is doing so uh, with the same um, instruments. And of course, uh, we'll respect social distancing as well. That was Eric Yao AJ coming through with that report. 